guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting for you to episodes 11 and 12 of Summertime Renderings. Let's go ahead and get started with episode 11 and 3, 2, 1, go. Wouldn't it be interesting if they also run down there, like, with Shin? Because you know Shin and them are currently down there! I feel like I'm never going to look at babies again because of this. Because I never thought I would see shadow babies with no head, where their eyes are and stuff. Like, mm-mm. It's cool. Creepy. My two favorite things. <laughs> but, oh. Oh. Yeah. Mm. I mean, hey, so's right. You know, you gotta have that. Oh! Nice shot. <laughs> Cody, go play. Hmm? No, don't go over there. No, 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 no. Meal. Oh. 
Seriously, you saw nothing? I don't trust this! Uh-uh, we ain't going down there. Me, I don't be stupid! I mean, he's down there. Don't be stupid. Don't be stupid. Don't go down there. Don't go down there. Be a smart girl. Smart. You stay home. Stay home. Don't go down there. Right? But this is a shadow. Yeah, exactly. Hell to the naw. Nah, nah, nah. I ain't going down there. <laughs> the lies he tells. <laughs> I think so. Oh, that is definitely impossible. What? Oh, okay, because I was about to say, did they print the C, too? Like, we, we can do that. Like, mm. Yeah, way too dangerous. You need to move. Mm. No, you're not. So what can you do? Because she had no choice! No, 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 no. Who the fuck is that? Is that what your is? What the fuck? Well, I mean, uh, we all knew she was a traitor in ish because of what happened in the other thing. And I was thinking, nah, she's fine now, but okay, explain that now.
This is still such a bad idea. We should just turn around. Shit. Mio, you a little reckless. I get that. I like that about you. But hold up, man. Like, mm mm. Exactly. It could be a trap. Exactly. What the fuck, honey? What the fuck? When the hell does she... But see, how do we... How are we 100% sure that she's a shadow, though? Yeah, not a shadow. Mm. She's not a shadow. Actually, um, yeah, we can do that to humans, too. Yeah, what, girl, what the hell? Oh, okay. Mm -mm. That's the creepiest thing that someone can do when they have their eyes closed is open their freaking eyes. I thought he was going to shoot himself. But then why did your dad choose you? Great. Mm-hmm. 
This guy forsaken child. No. Exactly. Get the fuck out. And neither of you need to die in this situation. So just go. Damn. So Shinpei's gonna have to go back in time again. That don't sound good. Oh, because the Mia's the only one that you have. But she's gonna find out, though. Mm. 
mother. All right. Time out up in this shit. Um, interesting episode. Yes, yes. I, I, I hate the fact that what's his face is not dead. And, and homegirl slash her brother, she about to die because she got shot in the liver, and that's not the greatest place that you want to get shot at. Because you know, oof, you will die very quickly with that amount of blood loss and such. But um. Yeah, this was an episode. This was an episode. It really, truly was. Was not expecting that to go down the way it did. Especially with Homegirl show's sister and her play into this. Because, I mean, with, okay, with the first time that we found out that she was a traitor, yeah, we knew she had some sort of part in it, but we just didn't know what. Now we're kind of getting that information, especially with um between her her and her dad but it just makes you wonder also why their dad didn't have show in this as well because maybe show wasn't destined to do it as much as his sister like almost very similar to um sakura from fate and you know her quote-unquote brother and such and how at first she originally wasn't supposed to be in it it was more of her brother and then in the alternate series you know um, Heavensville, she is in the situation of with being with fighting with the other masters and shit like that. So who really knows where we're going with this show once again? I, I mean, um, it can only go up from here because probably, yeah. And then okay, Mio and, and Tetsu, where are they gonna go? Well, what's the face of Shadow? Like clearly, that is a trap. You can kind of tell that that's a trap. It's very obvious that it is. But at the same time, I could be completely wrong. Like, maybe they're, she's showing, this shadow is being, like, good, like, Ushino, and being sweet and such. But at the same time, this shadow seems like it's leading them on. And it, it's just like, hey, y'all about to die in this next episode. So I really wouldn't be surprised if everyone who is still currently alive is going to die in episode 12. And in the end, Shin is definitely going to have to go back in time again to prevent all of this from happening. But go ahead and pause the video and I will see you guys in one second for episode 12. Alrighty, episode 12 in 3, 2, 1, go. Okay. They don't be reckless. Because that hoe wants you to do something. That hoe wants you to. That hoe want him to get mad, which is too late. He already did. It's such. She over here, like, yeah, 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 yeah. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Think, yeah. You think I ain't going to do it? You think I'm going to do it? Yeah, yeah. Oh, Jesus, Lord. Oh, my God. Mm. Mm. Damn.
Of course, that would irritate anybody. Yeah, and that police, the police officer who passed away So you give the bodies. Oh. People. at the same time these are still innocent people though Oh my god. It's so fucked up to say. That now changes everything. We can't get... What in the world are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going? Oh. You gotta stop her before she eats her. Mm-hmm. 
Oh God, the shadow demon babies. Because this is wrong! You, I mean, you can't run now. You gotta fight that thing. That too. But of course, at the same time, she is gonna be reckless and put herself into danger. You're right. The fucking thing got me, oh! Killer. Well, that was a lie, obviously. No, no, no. That's a lie, baby.
question. How the fuck did you and Mio get lost? How y'all get separated? What's going on? How did Shadow get Mio? Really? I mean, there's no time to be like, yeah, let me add all your boobs real quick, bruh. <laughs> That's how the shadow copied it. No hospitals. Mm -hmm. While in a way, she needs to kill himself. Holy shit!
The poison. I mean, because it can kill him quickly. It will. But it's the only choice. Yeah, I mean, yeah, he he going so. Um. <laughs> hmm? Hmm. Oh. Oh, yeah, because a lot of people died in this episode. Woo! It's all right. Now, all right, we're back right there. Okay, can we also speak? Hey, if this happens, we all go and die on this day. Oh. Okay. Oh. Fucking K, because it's going to be interesting to have Shin explain what just happened now. And, and I think she's just going to be like, all right, what the fuck? Damn. Okay. Really, honestly, this show is just giving me like, how, damn, how can we have Shin die this week or in this episode? Because he is dying in the most crucial, crazy ass ways. But it's interesting, though. I, I mean, okay. And Mother comparing Shadow Ushino to the egg. Like, the, the saying, what came first, the chicken or the egg, da 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 and everything. But, because we, we know still there's stuff special on her. Her her shadow is different. She's like the light, almost like, not like a considerable saving grace in a way. I don't know. But damn, Mio died again in this episode. Uh, show and his sister what's his face tetsu like everybody died in these last two episodes like jesus like woo everybody's like yeah like oh my god and i really thought like you know um what's her face had shot hey like shin in a way i'm like oh okay we gotta win no 
once I saw like the 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 glasses and how it was open and it was bloody, I was like, oh damn, she's dead. Oh, th this was a win and a loss at the same time. I, I just, mm, I I can now see why this episode was called Bloody Night. Like Jesus, because this was very bloody. Like damn, I I mean I knew I figured it was, but I didn't think it was gonna be that freaking bloody. I mean it was good. It was good. We did learn a lot more, a couple more things about this. Like, okay, yeah, the situation on the fact that shows mom is a shadow and such, and, and the uh, the partnership that the shadows and his dad has with them, and that you know they're they're plotting to say fuck this plan that we've had, this agreement that we've had for so many generations and years. Everybody is dying on the night of the festival. No one is coming out of this alive. Like literally said to you went away fuck you and your family and, and everything else i'm taking all y'all like damn that's fucked up this show crazy <laughs> like really this show is crazy and the fact that this is also going to be turned into a game too bruh how is this gonna go like is it gonna be very much like a visual visual novel-esque there's so many things that they could do with this. And, and it's going to be like multiple freaking endings where it's like, okay, like no, not only with the typical visual novel thing, but like, you know how like when Persona has like the several multiple bad endings that you can get before you get to the quote unquote true ending. Like, especially if you've played Persona 5 Royal, um, you have the vanilla op um, endings, which are like the two bad, like the two, like, several endings that you, like I said, that you can get way before any of the games super duper early, especially when you're first playing it, and then especially if you don't go in into the palace and stuff and something happens to you and everything, da -da -da -da, you get arrested, or you get dispelled, shit like that, if you plan it, you know, you know, if you haven't, go look up for those endings, they're very interesting, I'm just saying, or even, even though I have not officially watched, like, a whole play, uh, playthrough of SMT5, those endings and how very interesting a lot of people said those were but you know because of the fact is smt5 didn't sell the greatest and such that's why it's like one minute was hugely talked about now it's not as much talked about and such but yeah it, it feels like with this show we're getting into the multiple different endings like every single time when shin has to kill himself that is one bad ending that's an ending that okay because this happened we have to do this this is a bad end so let's kind of make sure that we don't go that route again to initiate initiate quote unquote this bad ending if you understand that term in a way but yeah both of these episodes are fucking good like jesus very brilliant but other than that guys that is my reaction view towards episodes 11 and 12 of summertime rendering if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel and make videos every single day join the monster squad and of course i will see you guys officially all next saturday for patreons and next monday for everybody else for episodes 13 and 14 bye guys